started. So, um, tell us about the unique selling point of this place, you know. Well, actually, I mean, look, there are so many gift and souvenir uh, boutiques or shopping complexes in Sri Lanka. Our unique selling point is we are the one and only actually gift and souvenir emporium which is open till 10 o'clock uh, in the night, uh, facilitating the customers and 365. That means around the, around the, actually, I mean, throughout the year, we are open till 10 o'clock in the night. So we see a lot of uh, arts and crafts around. Um, how does Laka Arcade help the craft entrepreneurs? Well, actually, I mean, we have a supply base of about 10,000 craft entrepreneurs spread out all over Sri Lanka. Uh, and we are very proud to say uh, we have become the ears and eyes of the uh, underprivileged craft entrepreneurs, showcasing their products and giving them the due, the products, the due respect, and actually, I mean, taking out to the entire world. Uh, you must have actually seen there how 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 well we have displayed it and what type of respect we have uh, actually towards those products. So we are showcasing their products and we want to give them the best possible price for their products and actually I mean help them uh, as a, some sort of a backward integration. So since we spoke about how Lak Arcade help craft entrepreneurs, they would like like they might like to know how they could supply their products to you guys and get a good rate in that. So yeah, that's right. can you? Yeah. Sure. Actually, I mean, first of all, actually, I mean, uh, we request them to register themselves with us. Uh, there's a proper, actually, I mean, method of registration, and they can bring us the samples. Then we will go through the samples. We have a panel of experts uh, on each uh, product category. They go through the samples and based on quality, price, their availability, their actually, I mean, uh, uh, capacity to supply uh, throughout, uh, and we will actually, I mean, place an order with them and we will do a test market actually i mean some sort of a test marketing campaign uh, with the products after that we will place the orders and we'll have a, a continuous uh, actually i mean supply chain relationship with them so uh, since you spoke about quality what are the quality standards that you implement in lakka arcade because like we see there are a lot of quality products right nothing differs right so how do you maintain this well uh, yeah we are, we are very, very actually, I mean, uh, proud and very, how to say, uh, uh, concerned about our reputation as a supplier of quality gift and souvenir, novelty gift and souvenir products to the market. So we strive our level best to maintain actually, I mean, those standards. And actually, when we procure, it's a lengthy process, when we procure, I mean, it goes through a panel of actually experts who specialize in those actually, I mean, different, different fields. Uh, and they go through the products and then only if they are satisfied on the standards only uh, we will actually I mean uh, procure them. Uh, the classic example is the gem and jewelry sections where I, you are standing. Uh, all gems actually since it's a very high value product we are very concerned about the quality. All the gems uh, offered for sale here are certified by the National Gem and Jewelry Authority. So while I was walking out of all the products this elephant caught my eye. Um, what's the specialty in this? Well, first of all, I should congratulate on your sharp, actually, I mean, eye and sharp attention for quality. This is the unique item, actually, we very proudly, I mean, offer to the customers. This is a replica of the royal tusker, Raja, carrying the sacred tooth relic uh, of Lord Buddha in the uh, Asala Pirahara, the greatest pageant of uh, actually Sri Lanka, which is happening every year. And the uniqueness here is there's more than 386 sapphires, blue, yellow, pink, orange, white, uh, mounted in it and totally handmade. This weighs more than one kilogram of sterling silver. Mr. Ajit, uh, one of your employees said that this picture is made out of gems. Is that true? It is true. Oh. In fact, actually, I mean, this is one of our latest products. This is made out of uh, precious as well as semi-precious gemstones. Actually, I mean, small pieces. Mm -hmm. Actually, I mean, uh, they have been actually glued into this mm -hmm. and created this picture. So, Mr. Ajit, just like we are playing chess, how we are going to overcome the problem of competitors? Well, as you rightfully said, business uh, as well as life is a game of chess, right? Yes. Uh, our strong point is daily we are we are evolving ourselves. Actually, I mean, we go for new techniques, new designs, new technology, and we work very closely with design actually experts, visual merchandising experts, product experts, and 
mean uh, actually graduates from uh, various design actually I mean uh, schools and they come here they very closely interact with the suppliers and they bring about the best uh, actually I mean hidden in them and we provide them a nice platform for that product so they, daily we have actually I mean uh, we have no fear about our competition we know that we are far ahead of them and that's our strength as a socially committed shop or maybe an ex exquisite shop what is your future plan or what are your future plans for the society and for the environment of Sri Lanka well actually I mean uh, being a very socially committed a company who is co committed for environmental protection and eco-friendly practices we have actually I mean we have launched a project in order to replant uh, these actually I mean uh, locally well-known Khaduru balsa food which is actually I mean uh, used extensively for mass carving and we have actually I mean uh, taken steps in order to replant uh, this particular actually variety and uh, uh, we are very proud to say Wildlife and Nature Protection Society they have come in that they have agreed to monitor this project and they are going to work very closely with us I think actually it's our duty to give back something to the nature so this is our small way of giving back to nature and you, as you know nowadays the foreign actually foreigners they are committed to environmental protection so actually I mean uh, they will actually definitely will be incentivized for them to purchase from us if they know that we are committed to preserve the environment and uh, actually, I mean, uh, uh, we are eco-friendly and our practices are eco-friendly and ethical, most of all. Thank you.